What is going on guys? Welcome back. Taking a look at the third wildcard game this week in the Chargers at the Ravens. This is the one I understand the absolute least. I'm going to show you the simulation. We're going to go back and discuss what happens. All right, so Phillip Rivers and the Chargers get a victory, 34-17, to in Baltimore, a game that really could cost John Harbaugh contract extensions aside issues as we move into next year. Talks about maybe him leaving anyway. But here's the interesting thing. We all know the actual scenario here. Lamar Jackson goes 29 for 40, rookie quarterback, almost 350 yards, no touchdowns. Phillip Rivers, 21 for 31, three touchdowns. Ty Montgomery, not a workhorse back. 26 carries only spelled six times by Dixon, yet you take a look at Melvin Gordon, who we know is a workhorse back, 25 carries, and only spelled by Eckler twice. Now, the interesting other part of this is it was a close game. It was closer than it looked. It was 17-14 to 14 at the end of the third. Why are you putting all that pressure on one running back or a rookie quarterback when you've got other playmakers that can go down the field? It just doesn't make sense to me how the Ravens, really how this game simulates football sometimes. Give you a shot at the defensive numbers. Love to know your thoughts on this. Appreciate you checking out. I will be back very shortly with more commentary. 